Yeah. Good morning. I'm Darko. I'm the artistic director of Hartford Stage, and this is Elizabeth. I'm the dramaturg and director of new play development. And we are seated on the set for Twelfth Night, which is playing at Hartford Stage right now. But we are here to tell you a little bit about our next season, which is Hartford Stage's 50th anniversary. And we've planned a glorious birthday party in a magnificent season. So we're going to begin in the fall with a return to Hartford Stage's roots in classical theater. We're going to do two classics in repertory, which is the same company performing both plays. We're going to open with Marivaux's 18th century comedy, La Dispute, in a new adaptation that Darko and I are doing. It's a really funny, sophisticated, and somewhat cruel comedy about love. We're going to do it in repertory with... Macbeth. Shakespeare's great tragedy. It's swift, relentless, terrifying um, play about a wrong choice and the consequences of that choice. And it's also, I think, about love um, in an odd way. So, uh, so the two plays, I think, that's wonderful thing about rep, how the two shows work together, um, how they speak to each other. And after that, we're taking a gear shift. We're going to do a new production of Steve Martin's The Underpants. It's a ribald, rowdy comedy written by Steve Martin, who is indeed that Steve Martin, and directed by Gordon Adelstein, the artistic director of Long Wharf Theater. That'll be a co-production between us and Long Wharf. And following that, we are doing Noel Coward's beautiful and bittersweet song at Twilight a play about a man and two women in his life and the choices that they made many years ago and how those choices have shaped their lives. And this beautiful, sophisticated play will be directed by Mark Lamos, who ran Hartford Stage for 18 years. After that... We're going to do a production of Matthew Lopez's beautiful new play, Somewhere. Matthew has been our Etna New Voices Fellow in residence at the theater this season, and we're really excited to have him and the director Giovanna Sardelli here to do his play, which is about a Puerto Rican family in New York at the time that West Side Story is storming Broadway and about to be made into a film, and how their dreams of success on the Great White Way intersect with the actual urban reality. The last show of the subscription season is Love and Other Fables, and uh, this is another musical comedy premiere coming on the heels of Gentleman's Guide to Love and Murder, and it's a big, funny, romantic uh, musical with a very tuneful score that reminds me of Rogers and Hart and Cole Porter and with a great deal of tap dancing. So, in, so next spring, to end the season, there'll be 14 uh, people uh, dancing up a storm on our stage to end the season on the celebratory notes. So we hope you're going to join us. And in addition to the six shows... We're also going to give a whole new gloss and a sort of revival and re injection of energy to Michael Wilson's adaptation of A Christmas Carol, which we've been doing for 15, 15 years. years. And the 50th anniversary seems like a good time to give it kind of new life because we know how beloved the production is in Hartford. So we hope to see you at the theater.